in the quiet town of Monroe, Louisiana, the shocking murder of Michael Robinson Jr. set off a chain of events that would uncover a web of deceit and the devastating consequences of gun violence. Tonight, we bring you a gripping tale of justice, redemption, and the importance of due process for all individuals. Hello my lovely viewers, in a recent case that has left the community in disbelief, we delve into the chilling investigation of Michael Robinson Jr.'s murder, what started as a confession from an 18-year-old suspect, Michael Mitchell Jr., soon revealed startling contradictions, casting doubt on the truth behind the implicating statements. Tonight, we follow the dedicated detectives as they painstakingly unravel the intricate details of this case, navigating through conflicting documents and pursuing justice with clarity and diligence. But as the truth begins to emerge, we're reminded of the broader issue at hand, the urgent need to address gun violence that plagues our society. As we seek to understand the depths of this tragedy, we find hope in the resilient community that rallies for justice and advocates for a safer world. But the road to justice is fraught with challenges, and innocent lives hang in the balance. And that's not all. Later in the program, we bring you an empowering message from Cultivate What Matters, an organization dedicated to cherishing life's moments and promoting positive change. Their mission aligns perfectly with the themes in this case, reminding us of the importance of cultivating what truly matters in the face of adversity. But first, we take you into the heart of the investigation with exclusive clips from the police body cameras, providing an ever-before-seen glimpse into the pursuit of truth and justice. Join us as we delve into this gripping tale and explore the profound impact of gun violence. Together, we'll uncover the power of unity, advocacy, and a relentless pursuit of truth. Stay tuned for this powerful story and a special message from Cultivate What Matters. Don't go anywhere. The truth awaits next. I will show your actual body camera photo age of the moments the Louisiana State Trooper uncovered a young man's victim inside of her our vehicle and swiftly jumps to make her heroic arrest. There's some contact with Monroe PD called Regus, somebody named Regus or something. Hey, Scooter, do you work with a Regus? Do you work with a any with a guy named Regus? R A G U S. Yeah, is there like an investigator named Regus or something? Okay, well, somebody the Franklin Parish Sheriff's Office just called said there's some contact with Monroe PD called Regus, somebody named Regus or something that this car. This car has been given to this boy by another boy who's been reported missing. And and something's going on between the two of them. And this boy right here said that that other boy gave him permission, but Monroe, the guy from Monroe hadn't called me yet, so I'm trying to, to see. He said he was going to, the Franklin Parish dispatch was going to try to confirm all this and get back with me, but um, evidently, I mean, he got the three bullet holes in it, and the boy's been reported missing. Do we need to do anything with specific with the car? Like, do we need to... Okay, man, I just don't want something bad to come back on this with with me letting it go. Um, okay. All right. Well, if I if if I need any help, I'll call you back. I'm sorry to bother you, Scooter. Okay. All right, man. Go ahead. I'll if I need you, I'll holler back. Bye bye.
Hey, Chad. Like, this looks close. Like, like bam, 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 bam. Yeah. In the boat. Okay, see. See? What, a, what, a, what I'm being told is that the boy who gave him permission to use the car is missing. So he's lying his ass off. We go looking for the person who owns the car, find out that the, the son of the owner of the car is missing. And now we got bullet holes all in the car. I got you. So, something's... Something bad, right? The only thing he lied about was his address in Winsboro. So, he don't have a driver's license, but he lied about living down here. I don't think, I don't know what he thought that was going to do. But, but he lived in Monroe. Lives in Richwood. And the, and the, the, the car is registered out of Monroe to the... I don't, I don't know who's supposed to be calling me. They said somebody was supposed to call me. The y'all sheriff's office said somebody was calling me. Yeah. If he's if he's knows something about this boy that's missing, there's bullet holes. I'd like to at least. We need good. I guess I'll do as much good contact as I can. Uh, yes, sir. The only, I just looked in the console, the center console. He had a doobie in the, the ashtray thing. But I really didn't give it a good look. Right. Right. See? I'm gonna do the obvious thing I want to do. Hey. Yep. Put your hands up. Put your hands up. Put your hands up. Put your hands behind your back. Put your hands behind your back. Don't move. Do you understand? Don't move. To get you in the court of law, you have a right to an attorney. Have one present during any questioning. At any time, you can choose not to make any statements or answer any questions. Do you understand? If you cannot afford an attorney, one will be appointed to represent you by the court. Do you understand? Do you understand? Who is that? Who is that? Who is who? That's Mike. That's Mike. How did Mike get there? Tell me. It wasn't me, man. It was. Okay. I just hit him. I just hit him, bro. I did. You just hit him? I did. I did. Okay. Lock, lock this down. Lock this down. F-39 to Region 3. F-39. Get in there. Get in there. Region 3, F-39. I am 10 15. 10 26 is 125 0357. 125 0357. F39 Troop F Desk. Greetings, dear viewers. Thank you for joining us once again on our channel. Today, we delve into a profoundly saddening case that sheds light on the importance of raising awareness and fostering understanding within our society. However, before we proceed, we'd like to express our deepest gratitude to our incredible sponsors, whose unwavering support allows us to bring you this valuable content. In today's story, we uncover a heart-wrenching event that serves as a stark reminder of the challenges we face as a society. 
It compels us to address important issues and work towards a world where empathy and understanding reign supreme. Have you been looking for a way to bring more intention and purpose into your life? Look no further. I highly recommend checking out Cultivate What Matters. They offer incredible resources and tools to help you prioritize what truly matters, set meaningful goals, and live a life filled with purpose. And guess what? Our viewers get an exclusive 20% off by using my code Madison Adeline at checkout. Don't miss out on this fantastic opportunity to cultivate what truly matters in your life. Check out the link in the description below. And speaking of justice, have you checked out our exclusive suite like Justice Hoodie? It's not just a piece of clothing, it's a statement. Show your support for equality, fairness, and standing up for what's right. Grab yours today and join our movement for a better world. Find the link in the description below. This heart-rending incident underscores the urgency of fostering empathy and compassion within our communities. In the wake of this terrible event, it becomes increasingly evident that raising awareness about mental health concerns is crucial. By shining a light on the importance of recognizing and addressing mental health issues, we can strive for a society that offers support, understanding, and resources to those in need. Understanding is a powerful tool in combating tragedy and building a harmonious society. By promoting inclusivity, acceptance, and empathy, we can bridge divides and foster an environment where everyone feels valued and heard. Let us join hands to create a world that embraces differences and promotes unity. Today, we pay tribute to the lives lost in this senseless act of violence. Amidst the darkness, let us not forget to kindle the flame of hope. Through open conversations, increased access to mental health services, and collective efforts, we can create a future where tragedies like these become a distant memory. Mental health should be prioritized and integrated into the fabric of society to prevent such tragic incidents from recurring. As we reflect on this heartbreaking story, we are reminded of our responsibility as a society to foster awareness, understanding, and empathy. By uniting and advocating for change, we can build a brighter future where no one feels isolated or unheard. Together, let us make a difference, one step at a time. As we reflect on this heart-wrenching story, it serves as a reminder to cultivate what truly matters in life, love, acceptance, and compassion. If you would like to support the families during this difficult time, please consider contributing to their GoFundMe campaign. Link in the description. Additionally, mental health support is crucial. Let's work together to break the stigma surrounding mental health and advocate for better access to treatment and support systems. Finally, we want to thank our sponsors, Cultivate What Matters and Polaris Adventures, for their support in sharing this story. We also invite you to explore the world of adventure with Polaris Adventures, who provide unique experiences to create memories that last a lifetime. You can find the link in the description down below. Life is short, and every moment counts. In the face of tragedy and uncertainty, we're reminded of the importance of embracing life's adventures and living each day to the fullest. That's why we're excited to partner with Polaris Adventures, the ultimate destination for thrilling experiences and unforgettable memories. Picture this, the wind in your hair, the open road ahead, and the freedom to explore the world around you. Polaris Adventures offers an array of exhilarating activities, from off-road expeditions to snowmobile tour, ensuring that your thirst for adventure is quenched. But it's not just about the thrill, it's about the deeper connection we forge with ourselves, our loved ones, and the world around us. It's about cherishing the beauty of nature and experiencing the freedom that comes with exploring uncharted territories, in times like these. When the fragility of life is brought to the forefront, it becomes even more crucial to seize the day, embrace the unknown, and create memories that will last a lifetime. Polaris Adventures empowers you to break free from the ordinary and embark on extraordinary journeys that will leave you breathless. So, my friends, I invite you to join the movement and live your life to the fullest. Whether you're a thrill seeker or a nature enthusiast, Polaris Adventures has the perfect experience waiting for you. 
Discover the beauty of the great outdoors, unleash your adventurous spirit, and create stories that will be told for generations to come. Visit the link in the description below to book your next adrenaline pumping adventure with Polaris Adventures. Life is calling. Are you ready to answer? Whether you're an adrenaline junkie or simply want to explore the beauty of the great outdoors, Polaris Adventures has you covered with their incredible membership and rental options. With the Polaris Adventures membership, you gain access to a world of excitement. Imagine having the freedom to choose from a wide range of off-road vehicles, snowmobiles, and other adventure equipment. You can embark on thrilling expeditions across rugged terrains, conquer snow-covered landscapes, or navigate winding trails with ease. As a member, you'll also benefit from exclusive perks, such as priority access to new releases, discounted rental rates, and access to member-only events and gatherings. It's like being part of a vibrant community of like-minded adventurers who share the same passion for exploration and adrenaline-fueled experiences. But what if you're not ready for a long-term commitment? No worries. Polaris Adventures offers flexible rental options that allow you to choose the duration and vehicle that best suits your needs. Whether you're planning a weekend getaway, a family outing, or a solo expedition, Polaris Adventures has the perfect rental solution for you. Their rentals are designed to provide you with the ultimate convenience and peace of mind. Each vehicle is meticulously maintained and thoroughly inspected, ensuring your safety and enjoyment throughout your adventure. Rent a day use pass to have a variety of Polaris vehicles delivered to your door or pick one up at one of their off-road tracks for the ultimate experience. So, whether you're craving the thrill of off-roading, the serenity of snowmobiling, or the joy of exploring new horizons, Polaris Adventures is here to make your dreams come true. Visit the link in the description below to learn more about Polaris Adventures memberships and rental options. Start your journey towards unforgettable experiences today. Embrace the freedom, ignite your spirit of adventure, and embark on a journey that will leave you with memories to cherish for a lifetime. Thank you to Polaris Adventures for sponsoring this video and empowering us all to live life to the fullest. Well, family and friends continue to honor the life of a young man who was killed last week. Michael Robinson was murdered during an attempted robbery and found stuffed in the trunk of a car. Perry Robinson is at Carroll High School where they held a balloon release this evening. Perry, what more can you tell us? Well, Jennifer, Robinson's family told me that Michael's death has been hard on everyone. He was on his way to graduating from Grambling State University this fall, just before his life was cut short. Michael Robinson's family described him as the type of person who loved people and always wanted to talk. So when nobody heard from him last week, they knew something was wrong. When he went missing, we knew something was wrong because it wasn't like him. The 23-year-old was shot and killed during an attempted robbery. His body was found stuffed in the trunk of a car after Louisiana State Police stopped 18-year-old Michael Mitchell Jr. for speeding. Mitchell confessed to the crime and faces a second-degree murder charge. He was planning on becoming a state trooper. He already had his application. He was getting ready to submit this week, and he was looking to move, um, get an apartment in Dallas and start his life there. On Tuesday, family and friends held a balloon release in his honor. Even though their family wants justice, Robinson's cousin considers this a lose-lose situation. As a community, we've been working really hard to fight racial inequality with the Black Lives Matter movement, and it just sucks when we lose a life to one of our own. Adrian Harris says he knows it won't be easy not having Mike around, but he says he can rest at night knowing he's in a better place. Mike was a very lively person, very positive, so we're all been, we've all been trying for the most part to just keep our heads up and you know pray because we know he's in a better place and he's no longer suffering. Well, Robinson's family did tell me that Mike and the suspect did know each other. A memorial to honor Michael's life is set for tomorrow. For now, reporting outside Carroll High School, Perry Robinson, KNOEA News. Jennifer, back to you. In the small town of Monroe, Louisiana, the murder of Michael Robinson Jr. sent shockwaves through the close-knit community. The investigation took an unexpected turn when 18-year-old Michael Mitchell Jr. pointed fingers at Cameron Powell, implicating him in the crime. The reasons behind Mitchell's sudden claim were rooted in a previous argument between the two young men. As the case unfolded, doubts emerged about the veracity of Mitchell's statement. 
A document filed in the 4th Judicial District Court contradicted his confession, suggesting that Cameron Powell was not involved in the murder. The Louisiana State Police, LSP, swiftly dismissed the second-degree murder charge against Powell, leading the district attorney's office to officially clear his name, but the damage had been done. The accusations had already taken a toll on Powell's reputation and emotional well-being. The discovery of Michael Robinson Jr.'s lifeless body in the trunk of a black Chevrolet Camaro during a routine traffic stop added to the gravity of the crime. Mitchell confessed to being involved in an armed robbery that escalated into a fatal shooting, blaming Cameron Powell for both the heist and the gunfire that tragically took Robinson's life. As the investigation continued, doubts and uncertainty loomed over the case. Conflicting documents and the suspicion surrounding Mitchell's confession highlighted the importance of due process and a thorough, unbiased investigation. The community rallied for justice, demanding clarity and seeking the truth behind Michael Robinson Jr.'s death. Detective Smith and his team were determined to find concrete evidence to uncover the real culprit. They knew that a life had been turned upside down due to a single false accusation. Cameron Powell's innocence had to be proven beyond a shadow of a doubt. The case served as a stark reminder of the delicacy of the justice system. Wrongful imprisonment was a nightmare come true for an innocent individual, and the burden of proof rested on the shoulders of those seeking justice. The town felt a weight of responsibility, knowing that they needed to protect the innocent while punishing the guilty, not the other way around. As the days turned into weeks and the weeks into months, Detective Smith and his team combed through every piece of evidence. They interviewed witnesses, re-examined forensic reports, and left no stone unturned in their pursuit of truth and justice. Finally, after months of relentless investigation, a breakthrough came. A new lead emerged, leading the detectives to a crucial witness who could provide the missing pieces to the puzzle. The witness's testimony shattered the web of lies and deceit that had been spun around the case. In a dramatic turn of events, the true perpetrator was identified, and it was not Cameron Powell. The guilty party was someone unexpected, a person with no prior criminal record. The motive behind the murder was shocking and had nothing to do with the initial argument between Mitchell and Powell. As the new evidence came to light, the community was both relieved and heartbroken, relieved that the innocent had been exonerated but heartbroken over the loss of Michael Robinson Jr. and the realization that their trust had been misplaced in the initial confession. With the real perpetrator behind bars, Cameron Powell's name was cleared, but the scars left by the false accusation would take time to heal. The justice system had worked, but not without a cost. The case of Michael Robinson Jr.'s murder became a cautionary tale. A reminder that the justice system was a delicate web that required careful consideration in every step of the process. It emphasized the importance of seeking justice with clarity and diligence, protecting the innocent while diligently pursuing the truth. As the community began to heal, they held on to the hope that this tragedy would lead to positive changes in the justice system, ensuring that such nightmares would not be repeated. The memory of Michael Robinson Jr. lived on inspiring a commitment to safeguarding the principles of due process and fairness for all individuals. Ladies and gentlemen of the jury, as we draw to a close in this emotionally charged case, let us not only remember the tragic loss of Michael Robinson Jr. but also the broader societal implications of gun violence that have been brought to the forefront. This heart-wrenching case has not only revealed the devastating consequences of gun violence but has also underscored the pressing need for collective action in addressing this alarming issue that plagues our communities. The events surrounding Michael Robinson Jr.'s murder serve as a poignant reminder of the far-reaching impact of gun violence. The sudden and senseless loss of a young life has left an indelible mark on his family, friends, and the entire community. It is an agonizing testament to the profound pain and suffering that gun violence can inflict upon innocent lives, tearing apart the very fabric of our society. In the pursuit of justice, we must acknowledge that this case is not isolated but representative of a larger problem that requires urgent attention. Gun violence continues to be a deeply concerning public health crisis, 
affecting countless families across the nation. It is a complex issue that demands a multifaceted approach, one that addresses not only the availability of firearms but also mental health support and systemic factors that contribute to violence. As we stand at the precipice of change, we must channel the emotions stirred by this case into meaningful action. We can make a difference by fostering open dialogue and advocating for comprehensive gun safety measures that balance individual rights with the collective welfare of our communities, engaging with our elected officials and urging them to prioritize responsible gun legislation can be a significant step towards preventing further tragedies like the one that befell Michael Robinson Jr. Now. Allow me to draw your attention to a beacon of hope amidst these dark times cultivate what matters. This organization embodies the values of nurturing what truly matters in our lives, promoting a vision of a world where love, compassion, and understanding thrive. Their mission aligns seamlessly with the profound implications of this case, as they believe that even in the face of adversity, we have the power to cultivate positive change. Cultivate What Matters offers a diverse range of products designed to help individuals cherish the moments that matter most. Their thoughtful planners and journals empower people to capture life's precious memories, set meaningful goals, and lead lives of purpose and intention. In a world often besieged by chaos, their products serve as guiding tools to center our focus on what truly matters family, community, and the values that bind us together. Relating to this case, Cultivate What Matters inspires us to reflect on the profound impact of gun violence, urging us to cultivate a world where compassion and understanding can prevail. Through their empowering tools, they encourage us to take action, both individually and collectively, to bring about positive change in our communities. Visit this link in our bio to dive headfirst into the organizational lifestyle brand that is changing lives of many of my amazing viewers. Thank you for all of the support this far. As we navigate the aftermath of this tragedy, we must remember that we are not powerless in the face of adversity. The tools provided by Cultivate What Matters offer us a way to channel our emotions and motivations into creating a world where the safety, security, and well-being of all citizens are protected. In conclusion, let us honor the memory of Michael Robinson Jr. by advocating for change and progress in addressing the pressing issue of gun violence. As we engage in meaningful dialogue and take concrete steps to ensure a safer future, let us also look to cultivate what matters for inspiration and guidance, embracing their vision of a world where the values of love and compassion thrive. Together, let us cultivate a society that cherishes what truly matters and stands united against the scourge of gun violence, ensuring that the tragic loss of Michael Robinson Jr. will not have been in vain. We can build a brighter future where no one feels isolated or unheard. Together, let us make a difference, one step at a time. As we reflect on this heart-wrenching story, it serves as a reminder to cultivate what truly matters in life, love acceptance, and compassion. We can embrace their spirit by spreading love and kindness in our own lives. If you would like to support the families during this difficult time, please consider contributing to their GoFundMe campaign. Link in the description. Additionally, mental health support is crucial. Let's work together to break the stigma surrounding mental health and advocate for better access to treatment and support systems. Finally, we want to thank our sponsors, Cultivate What Matters and Polaris Adventures, for their support in sharing this story. We also invite you to explore the world of adventure with Polaris Adventures, who provide unique experiences to create memories that last a lifetime. You can find the link in the description down below. Life is short, and every moment counts, in the face of tragedy and uncertainty. We're reminded of the importance of embracing life's adventures and living each day to the fullest. That's why we're excited to partner with Polaris Adventures, the ultimate destination for thrilling experiences and unforgettable memories. Picture this, the wind in your hair, the open road ahead, and the freedom to explore the world around you. Polaris Adventures offers an array of exhilarating activities, from off-road expeditions to snowmobile tour ensuring that your thirst for adventure is quenched. But it's not just about the thrill, 
It's about the deeper connection we forge with ourselves, our loved ones, and the world around us. It's about cherishing the beauty of nature and experiencing the freedom that comes with exploring uncharted territories. In times like these, when the fragility of life is brought to the forefront, it becomes even more crucial to seize the day, embrace the unknown, and create memories that will last a lifetime. Polaris Adventures empowers you to break free from the ordinary and embark on extraordinary journeys that will leave you breathless. So, my friends, I invite you to join the movement and live your life to the fullest. Whether you're a thrill seeker or a nature enthusiast, Polaris Adventures has the perfect experience waiting for you. Discover the beauty of the great outdoors, unleash your adventurous spirit, and create stories that will be told for generations to come. Visit the link in the description below to book your next adrenaline-pumping adventure with Polaris Adventures. Life is calling. Are you ready to answer? Whether you're an adrenaline junkie or simply want to explore the beauty of the great outdoors, Polaris Adventures has you covered with their incredible membership and rental options. With the Polaris Adventures membership, you gain access to a world of excitement. Imagine having the freedom to choose from a wide range of off-road vehicles, snowmobiles, and other adventure equipment. You can embark on thrilling expeditions across rugged terrains, conquer snow-covered landscapes, or navigate winding trails with ease. As a member, you'll also benefit from exclusive perks, such as priority access to new releases, discounted rental rates, and access to member-only events and gatherings. It's like being part of a vibrant community of like-minded adventurers who share the same passion for exploration and adrenaline-fueled experiences. But what if you're not ready for a long-term commitment? No worries. Polaris Adventures offers flexible rental options that allow you to choose the duration and vehicle that best suits your needs. Whether you're planning a weekend getaway, a family outing, or a solo expedition, Polaris Adventures has the perfect rental solution for you. Their rentals are designed to provide you with the ultimate convenience and peace of mind. Each vehicle is meticulously maintained and thoroughly inspected, ensuring your safety and enjoyment throughout your adventure. Rent a day use pass to have a variety of Polaris vehicles delivered to your door or pick one up at one of their off-road tracks for the ultimate experience. So, whether you're craving the thrill of off-roading, the serenity of snowmobiling, or the joy of exploring new horizons, Polaris Adventures is here to make your dreams come true. Visit the link in the description below to learn more about Polaris Adventures memberships and rental options. Start your journey towards unforgettable experiences today. Embrace the freedom, ignite your spirit of adventure, and embark on a journey that will leave you with memories to cherish for a lifetime. Thank you to Polaris Adventures for sponsoring this video and empowering us all to live life to the fullest.